actually, um, a friend of mine who has teenage sons uh, showed me one of their videos for class, and it was hysterical. Um, it was a video book report, and I remember doing those way back in the day when I was their age, which was um, the early to mid-90s, early 90s, late 80s. Yeah, I know. Anyway, um, their video was so hilarious, and I, I remembered us doing all the really silly things you know, a good grade, and I, I asked them, you got an A for that, right? I mean, they had stunts, really bad, very hilariously suburban, innocent stunts that were funny in their own kind of ironic way. By the way, I'm not at home. Um, this is Stardust Video and Coffee, or what's left of the video, which... Okay, um, yeah, I don't want to sort those out. I'm not really sure how that works anymore, so I'm just going to call it a decoration. So anyway, my video book report today, which I know is backwards. Maybe I'll be able to flip it around for you. Anyway, Danny Cavadlo's new Diamond Cut Abs, which is awesome. I'm sure you've heard a little bit of the buzz online about how cool it is. Here's the thing. Yes, it's a book about abs, but as a lot of us know, it's not just about abs. Abs are more kind of a side product of a lifestyle change, of a particular approach, and everyone's are different. So anyway, you'll really like this book if you're a fan of Danny and Al Cavallo. Danny makes some amazing faces in here, um, which if you've looked at the PCC blog, you've already seen, and there's some very funny discussions about a lot of them. Anyway, there's this one, which I'm super proud of this. Um, this was a really tough shot to do. and. Normally, um, doing pictures with Al and Danny, it's a very fast process, and we get things done like in the first or second, you know, maybe third or fourth take. But this clutch lever move is super hard. Um, I, I often, like, even almost have like a mental hang up with it sometimes. Like, I'll have to see somebody do it, and then I can do it. It's weird. Not to mention, uses a lot of grip strength. You're supporting pretty much almost your entire body weight on that bottom hand. Yeah, so even if you don't weigh that much, it's still relative difficulty. And then we had to synchronize the move with um, Danny and his cool outfit and his cool gestures. So that was a lot of fun. That is on page 147. Anyway, but you shouldn't skip to that because there's just so much here and there's so much entertainment, there's so much inspiration, there's so much information with it too. That's really the cool part. Um, he talks a lot about nutrition um, in here, and it's not the usual kind of party line. Um, it's what really works. And having, you know, seen what Danny eats, I can tell you this is what he does, and it works. Um, it's a simple approach. You don't have to think about, you know, your diets don't have to have like a, a name. It doesn't have to be a. I'm sorry. I think this thing makes my arms look weird. Okay, <laughs> but um. You know, it's just a very practical approach, and it's very similar to my own approach um, to nutrition, which I've uh, been talking about a little bit more lately. I'm always kind of scared to give out any sort of advice for legal reasons, but, um, you know, there's plenty of disclaimers, of course. But I can't overstate the importance of finding what works for you and what's sustainable for you and what's realistic for you. And also realize making a change to your lifestyle can be a gradual process. And, uh, you know, we're all at different places on that. Anyway, so back to the book. Um, he's got some workouts in here that are absolutely great. And, of course, tons and tons and tons of different exercises. That while they may say they're ab exercises, a lot of them are actually full body as well. You're going to get a lot of that tension. You're going to get a lot of just kind of balance a little bit with some of them and a ton of strength. I'm thinking about like sometimes I'll do pull-ups and if I do a whole lot of pull-ups like over the course of a day, the next day, <sighs> abs are killing me. Anyway, so for instance, here's the index of exercises. I'm really going to try to flip this around for you because I can't imagine how annoying that would be backwards. All right, well enough from me. Definitely check out Danny Cavadlo's Diamond Cut Abs. It's very cool. It's a lot of fun, and it's a lot of very good information. There's just little nuggets in here. 
that can really change things for you big time. All right, back to my coffee. I don't even know what this mug means.